Hello guys, if you are looking to run a large language model locally and privately and you want to expose it to an endpoint on your network and then access it either remotely or locally from that server, you can do that with LM Studio. Now LM Studio enables you to run that large language models locally on your server in your own private local network. All you need to do is to download it and then you can run it and I will show you how you can do it on the local system once you have it running lm studio natively run it runs it on your local host on the port 1234 now for now you can change the port and of course you would need to open that port on your firewall or security group or wherever you are running it and then once you have it the problem with lm studio is that it still doesn't allow you to expose it to 0.0.0, .0 or any public IP. There is no configuration file where you can set it. There are few hacks which you can do, but still it doesn't really support it. And I would highly discourage you to play around with its own uh, internal configuration because more often than not, it won't work. So what you need to do here is you need to load the model on your LM Studio, start the LM Studio's native local server, and then start serving that LLM on that server. Once that happens, you can whitelist the port 1234 or whatever port you are using, and then use any reverse proxy to, or an even VPN, I would suggest use a reverse proxy to use that LLM which is running on localhost to be run on any IP. Now there are heaps of uh, reverse proxies available. I will show you one example of caddy, but as I said, there are a lot of reverse proxies available. You can even use the uh, uh, very commonly used uh, Nginx reverse proxy through which you can access the LLM running localhost. Okay, so let me first show you how you can start serving that LLM locally by using LM Studio launch LM Studio and if you don't know what LM Studio is I have done various videos on LM Studio where I go into the detail as what exactly that is now just go to the home page of LM Studio uh, search for any model you want to serve for example I am searching with Beyonder and I already have uh, done this Beyonder's model video today it is a very good model for coding and role play anyway so I have downloaded it already and it is present on my local system if you click on this folder icon the file is already present there as you can see now once you have that file normally what happens is if you want to just chat locally with this model you will just click on these three icons and start chatting with this model after selecting the model from this middle but i already have i'm not going to chat with it we want to serve this model locally so for that just click on these local server tab on the left hand side once you are here just select the model from the middle and let's wait for it to load the heavier the model the longer it will take to load and this is bit heavy model of around 14 gig of size and i have one gpu of around 20 gb of vram on this server and my memory is 32 gb okay so the model is loaded now simply click on this start server before and before I you click that if I make it bigger you can see that this is a configuration this is the server default port if you want to change it to something else just select it and change it and you can do a lot of other things like cores and stuff if you're serving it on the website but I think for most of the cases this default configuration works just fine anyway so click on start server and you can see that it has started serving on the local machine now in order to access it all you need to do is to just use this curl command localhost 1234 let me make it a bit smaller sorry like this so this is simply a powershell if you don't know how to access it on your taskbar just click here type powershell and then right click and run as administrator it will open the powerful wind powershell window like this and once you have it just type curl your localhost port 1234 v1 model and it shows you what models are running locally on your system and this is how you can access it any of your restful apis and you can see once i do that it has shown me that this is the model which is ready to get all that information about that model 
or it just went up okay so this is how easy it is to use this sort of stuff here but this model is running locally what to do if you want to run it uh, if you want to access it remotely there is no way in lm studio where you can specify the ip address like i have done with this port so for that case i would suggest that you should work with some sort of engine uh, some sort of reverse proxy one of the commonly used reverse proxy is called as this caddy it is an open source one all you need to do is to go to caddyserver.com and from there just select uh, the platform as per your own platform it has free bsd various flavors of linux open bsd and also windows so i am running windows so i have already downloaded it it down it loads an exe so i would suggest you um, once you load it you can either run it as a daemon on your server or you can put it in your path and then access it from there for example for me uh, this is how you can do it for example i'm saying dot slash caddy reverse proxy dash dash from one two three four five and then whatever your public ip is and then press enter it is going to start caddy and for this you can start access it remotely and um, if you don't want to use caddy then there are various other options like i mentioned in gen x and stuff so that's it guys this is uh but i really do hope that lm studio uh provides us a way to just specify the ip address public ip address or whatever ip address you want to put so that we don't have to go this reverse proxy way i hope that you liked it if you are using any other way of doing it let me know very keen to learn if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you are already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching